waited for so long I've run aground I feel I'm burning up inside Oh hear me quiet I feel like everyone's alive videos the past weekend uh, really no explanation to it I have to make sure I never do that again because that's not good three days of inactivity I hate it um, had a pretty miserable weekend let's be honest uh, I didn't train at all but I did get up and wait 67.2 this morning which is um, 1.8 up from last week which is crazy good but you know um, yeah it's going well um, walking back from the gym hope you enjoyed the back ribs I didn't record um, the bicep footage but I had a good workout uh, I did back and biceps obviously as you saw and um, walking back now getting um, going to the store as well because I have to pick up some foods um, some meat some chicken some steak some fish and also some cereal for the morning and walnuts yeah, so I have to keep in mind that I have to get that. It's like a party weekend here in Holland right now. I hope the wind is okay. Um, and I don't like that all that festivity is like for Dutch people watching it's carnival and I hate carnival. <laughs> so uh, I'm like miserable alone and lonely because all my friends are you know it's like a party and everyone drinks a lot. I'm not really a big fan of that, so I just stayed home, watched some movies, hung out, did some work. Face Fitness. Face Fitness's anniversary is uh, this Sunday. It's one year anniversary. I'm just not sure what we're gonna do, if we're gonna do something, but it's pretty much, uh, it's a year ago since we started uh, the channel. Not started the channel, but uploaded the first video. So that's a pretty cool thing. But yeah, so the wind is okay. I hope the wind is okay, man. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the store. Yeah.
We've got a full box of food. We're ready to eat. Hi. Hello. <laughs> um, yeah. There's an old guy saying hi to me. But yeah, I got steak, walnuts, cereal, fish, and chicken. Easy money, easy gains. Alright, we're home. We've got a box of food. It looks more than it actually is because the cereal boxes are so big. There's only one thing on my mind right now. I need to fucking pee. Be right back. steak and rice as you can see and I'm gonna tell you a little bit about how I'm doing it with my macros and how I get them in and how I track them there's an app called my fitness pal I am um, previously recorded this in the video that I explained the whole macro thing um, but I left this part out because the video was getting way too long um, but I will do it really quickly so it's called my fitness pal it's a really good app so what I did I have all these foods in here basically you can track all your uh, macros in here and you can scan like for example I get this walnuts and if I want to know the macros um, I just click here and I add a food and I scan the barcode and it gives me exactly the macros so um, if because I weigh everything I can um, exactly do that because so um, okay so as you can see here this is the app and I click plus uh, food right so like that and then I do um, afternoon and then I have um, the rice in here I have this pre-made so this is 0 0.6 from 100 grams which is 60 grams obviously if it's 63 just um, change the number to oh, uh, 63 but it's um, 60 for me so that's great and then I add that and then it adds it to the um, to the um, macros of the day okay so and then I got the steak. So, for example, if we don't have the steak preset, you can type it in here and has a database and you can help you with um so it's called beef steak punches. And then you can see um this is the right one. And then you can see I had uh, 150 grams, so 100 times 1.5, and then you can see the calories, the fats, everything. So um I have mine pre-made, so I'm going to add that, this one, 0.5, add, and it adds to the macro. So it's a very easy way to track everything if you weigh, that's why people weigh their food because they don't want to know exactly how many grams they're getting and how much they're getting in. So um, yeah, I do this with everything, I'm gonna also going to take uh, a handful, which is approximately 10 grams of the walnuts uh, for some fats. And um, probably have a banana before dinner as well. Then I'm gonna have dinner, and then after that, um, I'm gonna see uh, what I have left. And then basically, you fill everything up. And uh, I don't really do if it fits your macros because if it fits your macros, it's basically that you, I mean, some some people just do it like, oh, now I can all I eat is ice cream, and, and if it fit my macros, then it's okay. Um, I I keep my my foods clean. Um, I'm not gonna eat like cake all day and ice cream, but um, if I do have some, uh, then I, I, I add it in there obviously and I take it into account, but I uh, keep my food as clean as possible. Um, you know, rice, steak, uh, walnuts and cornflakes with low sugar. Um, I have a lot of fruits. I have a lot of um, um, good protein and good fats, healthy fats, and then obviously some carbs. So yeah, that's about it for um, this part of the video. I'm gonna eat this now and I'll see you guys after that. Alright guys, so we got done eating our chicken and steak. And I forgot the veggies again. This is just my life. But I'm gonna show you guys how I <coughs> put in these walnuts in my fitness pal. So we go to my fitness pal. We click on the plus to add a food. And then let's scan 
do it like this and then scans it and it gives you the exact macros and then we do 0 0.1 for 10 grams focus come on why not focus man boom 0.1 that's 70 calories 6.6 .6 fat 0 0.9 um, saturated fat and we got 0.9 carbs and then we got 1.5 protein press ok and then ok and then it adds to the total and then you need I need this much left today which is a lot but we're also going to add a banana so I'm going to have that banana bow alright so that's going to be it for this video today Ooh, I forgot I had my earpieces in um, yeah, I showed you guys how I track my macros. If you want to download my fitness pal, it's free in the App Store or the Android Store. Pretty much uh, that it has that. So, thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.